is the Crew Motor Fest a Forza clone? Granted, this game from Ubisoft, at least visually, has much in common with Horizon 5, but it also outshines the Crew 2 with significantly enhanced graphics and meticulous attention to detail, enriched with more natural visuals for sunlight, rain droplets and mud. And trust us, it offers so much more. Let's look at 6 things where the Crew Motorfest leaves Forza Horizon 5 behind. Oh and by the way, we have hidden two easter eggs with special information in the video for you. But wait a second, something is wrong here. Oh no, we're back to 1979. Where did the beautiful graphics go? Bring us back to the present by liking, subscribing and turning on notifications. Oof, thanks. Now let's not waste any more time and jump right into number 6, the world. We must be honest, we had high hopes for this map, especially after experiencing the vastness of the Crew 2's USA map, which was just mind-blowing. Having the entire USA in a racing game set the crew apart and made it so damn special. But hey, even with that slight disappointment, we must admit this map beats Forza Horizon 5's by a long shot. Motorfest and Horizon 5 are cut from the same cloth and their vibes are strikingly similar, right down to the landscape. I mean, look at these mountains in the backdrop and those serene fields, man, uncanny similarities. Well, hands down, the Crew 2 still holds the crown for the best and biggest map, but with the scaled down version of the Hawaiian island of Oahu in Motorfest, it's like they took every great aspect of Horizon 5's map and amplified it to a whole new level. Motorfest's open world World is beyond impressive and completely blows us away. Planes and boats. The crew games are not your typical car games. They're a whole new breed, a thrilling vehicle spectacle. Like in Horizon 5, you will have over 600 vehicles, but the variety does not stop at off-road, sports cars and trucks. Just imagine this, you are cruising in a car one moment and the next you're tearing up the asphalt on a Ducati penny gale, pulling off wild moves and yes, popping wheelies like a pro. But wait, it doesn't end there. If you feel the need to soar high, you can transform into a freaking plane and take it to the skies. Sure, the plane physics might feel a bit off in this installment, but still, they've got planes here. Eat this horizon. And when the sailor's yarn grabs you, no worries, just hit a single button and boom, you're a captain on a boat sailing through the waves like a boss. And what's really cool is that you can import your beloved car collection and prestige items from the crew too into Motorfest. How awesome is that? Number 4. Crossplay and cross-platform in the Crew Motor Fest. It's true. Forza Horizon is an absolute racing giant and advanced in realism and car customization. But the fact remains that so far you can only play this beast on PC and Xbox. Motor Fest fills this gap coming for PlayStation 4 and 5 too. And what's even better is that this new crew title supports crossplay and cross-platform, meaning you can enjoy it with your friends whether on PS4, PS5, Xbox Series XS or PC. The color. Forza Horizon 5's graphics look damn realistic, but that also means we're dealing with rather raw and flat color dynamics. There's a reason why movie blockbusters come with high contrast, top notch color grading. To make things more exciting, Motorfest also goes in that direction, serving you big, bright, saturated colors that make your races visually a truly impressive, um, <laughs> Motorfest. <laughs> Next we have number 2, starter cars. Now hold on, these aren't your typical old school starter cars like a Peugeot 206 or a Fiat Punto from the classic Need for Speed days. No, these are the kind of early cars that make you question their starter status, but in the best way possible. Modern games often lack compelling vehicles at the beginning, but Motorfest hits the bullseye with these gems. Motorfest knows how to elevate the racing experience to a whole new level right from the very beginning. The choices here are absolutely thrilling. A small tip for the following. YouTube's video player gear icon and playback speed. And now number one, nitrous oxide, short NOS. Truthfully, Motorfest doesn't want to be a racing simulation like Forza Horizon 5, but instead focuses on diversity, exploration and much fun. This direction paves the way 
great for a trendy feature many would like to see in Forza, the Nitro Speed Boost or Short NOS. This acceleration option adds even more spice and excitement to your head-to-head -head races and also comes in handy when exploring the vast Hawaiian open world. Phew, six things from the Crew Motor Fest that might put Horizon 5 in the shade. But in the end, it's up to you to decide whether you want more variety and freedom or instead go for more realism. But it's a win-win for PS5 owners in any case. We are eagerly awaiting Motorfest's release date on September 14th. Thanks for watching. Do you think Motorfest can hold a candle to Forza Horizon 5 and which starter car would you go for? We look forward to your comment. If you like or dislike this video, show it with your thumb. Expect more videos soon and for more content updates in the meantime, as always, check out our website yourgames.tv and follow us on Twitter at yourgtv. See you in the next one, ballers.